So, it's only in church that we have a problem of doing things that we have seen being done by witch doctors. Oh, yes. Doing things that we have seen being done in the devil's camp. Oh, yes. Because we will say, there's a Satan. Let me tell you something. The devil is not a creator. He is a reactor. Oh, yes. He is not a creator of anything. He is actually a creature. Amen. So, whatever he does, is a copy again. That's, that's, that's why we have words like adaptation, manipulation. He is taking. Do you actually know that the power that the devil uses to bewitch you is the power of God? Oh, yes. Oh, God anointed the devil. Oh, yes. He was actually called who? An anointed carry. Mm -hmm. And what did he do with that anointing? Bewitch Christians, bewitch children of God. Oh, yes. Because he is simply converting the power that he was anointed with to cover. And now because he is now establishing his own, he is using it to establish his own, and his own is full of witchcraft. So what do you think he will use God's power? Now you are quiet. Tell your neighbor. Oh yes. Simba no royes kukumshakwe. Simba no royes kukumshakwe. He anointing him out. He anointing him out. He will push this one series. He will push this one series. If it is not of God, where did the devil go to? That was it. There is no power except by who? By God. Oh yes. All power belongs to God, including that which the devil is using. Oh yes, sir. Because the gifts and the callings of God are what? We don't repent it. So if God gives you, He will not take it away from you. And that's what happens with the devil. He was anointed. And he went away with the power. Oh yes. And he's now using it for his own cause. Uh -huh. I pray for you. Oh yes.